The first in a new line of immune-busting drugs approved for melanoma is presenting a new pathway for cancer doctors to explore. Melanoma cells are able to disguise themselves or camouflage themselves within our bodies. And what Keytruda does is it removes that camouflage. Used on late-stage melanoma patients, Keytruda delivered exceptional results for people who were out of options, proving the value of immunotherapy. We can then harness the power of our own bodies to fight off these cells that don't belong. Drugs like Keytruda reinforce the idea that it doesn't matter where a cancer originates. What's more important is what drives it. The same mutation found in melanoma may be present in other cancers, including lung cancer, where researchers are hoping for similar success. So it's being studied now in lung cancer. We've had some very interesting, very encouraging preliminary results for clinical trials. And um, we're hoping that as we move forward and we find out more about the drug, it's gonna end up being approved and, and effective in other malignancies. Several studies show the immunotherapy drug stalled progression and lengthened overall survival in about half test patients with the most common form of lung cancer, giving hope where there was very little. We now have a whole new pathway to target, a whole new area of investigation. Instead of targeting tumors, new drugs are harnessing the body's inner power. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.